I got a letter saying congratulations that I received the award. I got a letter in the mail saying you are eligible to be inducted. I received a letter, a letter announcing that I received the scholarship. The South Suburban College Foundation provides the scholarships that students use in order to attend the college. The foundation is a not-for-profit organization that was established with the intention of supporting South Suburban College. We're here to help the college with technology. We've done upgrades to classrooms, to the financial aid office. We've done a lot for our theater and performing arts programs to allow students the opportunity to do band tours, to productions such as Grease, our recent spring musical. Uh, things that might not otherwise be able to happen under the, a regular college budget. Education, in my opinion, is one of the keys to one's future and success. So it is critical that we make sure that everyone has the opportunity to participate in uh, getting an education or furthering their education. We're comprised of leaders within the community, 29 of the area's finest business, civic, and educational leaders. Uh, that uh, participate on the foundation board as a volunteer basis. Some students come from an economic background that may not allow them to go to school or they may not want to take on loans. And some of those individuals have great potential. And we wouldn't want to miss out on those individuals just because they couldn't afford school. I work so hard and I have a part-time job here at the school and I have a part-time job in retail and I've taken 18 credits and I just, I needed something to help me out. In one year we awarded over $130,000 in scholarship awards to students. And even that has grown since 10 years ago when we awarded about 30,000 in scholarships. So it's grown exponentially over the years. And that's, you know, at a school where the tuition is not incredibly high like some other institutions, that's an incredible amount of scholarships and that funds an incredible amount of students. It can be difficult going back to school, especially in this economy. So many of us are, are working part-time jobs trying to make ends meet. And to have any kind of financial assistance is really a great help. The donor drive is an ongoing process that we begin in September for each fall and what it is is an opportunity for people to make donations straight to scholarship funds and they're fully tax deductible. So it's a year-end tax deduction for individuals who want to establish scholarships at the college and primarily that's where the scholarship funds come from. It gives me great satisfaction to know that um, my dollars are going back to support individuals who someday hopefully will be sitting in this chair as uh, market president for BMO Harris Bank. The College Foundation is near and dear to my heart in that there is a scholarship fund that is named after my deceased mother, Carol Manning. Her emphasis with her children was to go to school. There were some students that have kind of fallen through the cracks that were in financial need, but financial aid and scholarship just wouldn't cover some of the costs and I thought it would be appropriate to start a scholarship fund in my mother's memory. Everybody is welcome to contribute to the donor drive. We look for support out in the community. Uh, we get wonderful support here at the college from our staff who do payroll deductions to support scholarships. And then our directors and individual donors as well set up the scholarship funds that they want to uh, establish. Some of them are annual awards and every year we get a few new ones that people decide they want to uh, establish a fund. The SOC Showcase event is another opportunity for people to participate and contribute to the foundation funds. It's also a fun night in that they have silent auctions and there's music and dancing. So it's a great opportunity to not only participate and donate, but also for people to get together and share some goodwill. Mr. Rush, the executive director of the foundation, has done an outstanding job. And Linda Mannix does a wonderful job in assisting Pat there's a good meal, a few cocktails, and many people look forward to this from year to year. The Academic Achievement Reception is uh, one of my favorite events that we have at the college. Uh, what it is, it's an award ceremony that we do at the end of every spring semester, and we begin the ceremony with our Phi Theta Kappa, our uh, honor students being inducted for the following year. And then we also do our scholarship awards and our de departmental awards. Many scholarships are awarded through the benevolence of our donors. Many of the donors show up 
to award the scholarship to the specific recipient. It's just a great event to allow us to see how much the scholarships mean to the students. Sometimes these are individuals who are first generation graduates from uh, a school of higher education and to me it gives satisfaction to see this happening and to see the reward not only for the students but for their families as well. I want a degree. I want to be first generation degree graduate from college um, and seeing the look on my mom's face how proud she was that I was honored to receive a scholarship that makes me really happy. The study of broad scholarships are a big part of what we do on the foundation and we believe that it's very important for students to have the overall college experience and having a competitive study abroad program is important to have at a community college. I was afforded the opportunity to travel and study abroad in China and that was through the foundation's program and that alone has been one thing that has, has propelled me to follow what I'm actually following. Our mission is to support the college programs and facilities technology improvements, but with a primary focus on student scholarships. The fact that we've been able to award so many more scholarships over the past 10 years and also grow our endowment so significantly really speaks to the generosity of the people in the community, uh, the great board of directors that we have, and uh, everybody here at the college that really is supportive of the foundation. What I would like to say is definitely thank you. Um, thank you more than anything. It's, it's an incredible encouragement to see that someone notices you and not just notices you and says good job and pats you on the back, but also says I'm willing to fund what you're doing with your life.